Hi, I'm David Gregg, and this week's video is a visit to the Audubon Society of Rhode Island's Nature Center and Aquarium in Bristol. This may be the Audubon Society's smallest preserve in Rhode Island, but as nature preserves go, this one is the Rhode Island of nature preserves. It's small, but it's packed with interesting things to see and do. Come with me and let's check it out. The Rhode Island Natural History Survey presents videos to showcase the animals, plants, geology, and natural systems that surround us, and the people and organizations working to understand and conserve them. Welcome, this is the Audubon Society of Rhode Island's Nature Center and Aquarium in Bristol, Rhode Island. The facility opened in July of 2000, so we're uh, coming on celebrating our 21st anniversary uh, in July. The center was built um, on 28 acres of land. It's one of Audubon's smallest wildlife refuges. We're actually sandwiched in between two condo developments. The property is long and narrow and goes all the way down to Narragansett Bay. Along the way, we connect with the East Bay bike path. The trail is about a mile round trip, takes most people about 30 minutes to walk it. Like all of Audubon's properties, the trails are open sunrise to sunset. There is no fee to walk the trails, so we welcome people to come at any time. As part of the property, there is the Nature Center and Aquarium, which is has a variety of aquariums and exhibits. This is the Northern Star Cor Coral. This actually started with a project with Roger Williams University, and it's done very, very well for us. The coral was actually um, collected from uh, Fort Wetherall in Jamestown. So this is local coral, and a lot of people don't know. They think coral, they think of the Caribbean, they think of the coral reef, uh, but we have coral right here in Rhode Island. So this is the star of the Nature Center and Aquarium for the Audubon Society. This is our 33-foot model of a North Atlantic right whale, completely life-size. A whale this size would be considered a juvenile. The North Atlantic right whale is the most endangered large whale in the world. The Audubon Society of Rhode Island is actually a partner uh, organization with the North Atlantic Right Whale Consortium. The North Atlantic Right Whale Consortium is a group of scientists from Florida all the way to Canada working to save the North Atlantic Right Whale from extinction. So this whale is used to educate people about that animal and what they can do to help save the North Atlantic Right Whale. So what we're doing here, this is our project for this spring. We had an old garden here. We hired a local landscape architect. We've worked with her before. Um, she redesigned this. She also designed our um, bioretention pond. And we're gonna plant all new native plants in here. It's gonna have a walkthrough. So this is gonna be our new bird feeding garden. We've just come down the trail from the Nature Center. We're here at the bottom of the field where the trail meets the East Bay bike path. Conveniently, there's even a bike rack there so that you can bike here and leave your bike and then visit the Nature Center.
Here we are at the East Bay Bike Path. Look both ways. And then cross over to the Salt Marsh. We've been fortunate to be able to offer some programs, both for children and adults. Uh, our youngest program is called Little Peeps. It's for one and a half year olds to two year olds. And then we go the gamut of programs all the way up through adults. We do have some virtual programs, but we are offering small workshops and other things right now. They're limited in, in amount of people that can come to be COVID safe. And people are um, asked to wear a mask and um, sit six feet apart and we're able to do all those programs successfully and have been able to do them since actually since the fall so you can find out about all of our upcoming programs on our website at www.asri.org and that stands for the Audubon Society of Rhode Island. Natural History Survey videos are made possible through the generous contributions of members and friends. Want to help us do more environmental science and conservation? Hit the like button, share our videos with your circle, subscribe, or make a financial contribution on our website, ranhs.org, or through Patreon. Thanks, and see you out there.